Man, I'm gonna tell you something. I've been on Facebook a lot, you know, COVID, at home alone, want some company, blah, blah, blah. I just want to talk to somebody, blah, blah, blah. There are so many scammers on Facebook, it's not even funny. It's disgusting. And luckily, I'm not a gullible idiot. But this is honestly the first person called KZ All Stars Abudun, former owner at Facebook Marketplace Assistant, says that I won $500,000 through a lottery promotion through Facebook. Even has the affidavit of claim, like I'm some idiot. Thank God I have common sense and I'm educated. This affidavit is obtained from Gary's Inn under the supervision of Lloyd's JB or Lord's JB Lloyd's. This is to affirm to you that your winning funds would be transferred to you in due course once all necessary procedure and rules have been observed. We congratulate you once again on your selection as a winner of this great event. Then she goes on to say, if it is a she, we are sorry for the announcement of your winnings prize to you. I am pleased to inform you of the result of the just concluded annual final draws held on the 1st of January 2020. Listen to that again. I am pleased to inform you of the result of the just concluded annual final draws of the just concluded annual final draws held on the 1st of January 2020 by Facebook group in cash promotion to encourage the usage of Facebook worldwide. Saying my profile was selected among the five lucky winners that was selected randomly for the winnings. I am delighted to inform you that your name was luckily selected among the ten lucky winners who won the sum of five hundred thousand United States dollars. Was selected among the five lucky winners that was selected randomly for the winnings. I am delighted to inform you that your name was luckily selected among the 10 lucky winners. <laughs> ah! These people, these people just think I'm fucking retarded. Right? Right? Excuse my language. Among the five, now listen, among the five lucky winners was selected randomly for the winnings. I am delighted to inform you that your name was luckily selected among the ten lucky winners who won the sum of 500000 United States dollars. I ain't even got to say it. <laughs> so there's five lucky winners selected. And all of a sudden, then I'm among the ten lucky winners. I am your claims officer. I am here to take you through the steps on how you will get your winnings. Are you ready to get your winnings? I said, okay. And if you notice, I'll go down. When she said all this crap, I said, thanks. Has any of our agent contacted you before concerning your Facebook account? No. I just, I played it off because I get so many damn scams. And then we'll deliver your winnings today. Question, question, question. I'm waiting. Really? This is some trick or some, probably some dude. Because I'll tell you, I've found that out a lot. I've seen that a lot. 
same shit every time. Women, somebody steals a picture of a girl, and you can tell, man. Because these people are so ignorant, and they do it so damn much, and they don't remember who they're sending this shit to, that they'll send the same girl under a different name trying the same fucking scam. Excuse my language again. And they'll say the same shit over and over and over and over again. First it's, hey, how you doing? Or, hey, what's up? Or, hey, how's it going? When you say, hey, that's all you got to say. They say, oh, are you single? Or are you married? Do you have kids? When I answer, I'm single. I say, I'm single. Then they say, um, do you have a WhatsApp? And I say, and because I'm already used to the shit, excuse my language again, I said, because they'll ask, if you, if you say you don't have a WhatsApp, then they'll ask, do you have Hangouts by Google? Yes. Then they'll ask for your email. You'll get into talking to them and everything. And then, whether it be, oh, my parents died in a car crash. Or, I mean, it's crazy the number of people that said their parents died. And it goes to asking for money. Or actually, not really asking for money. Asking for a card. Can you buy a card? Send it to me? <laughs> no. I mean, it's just disgusting. These people, boy. It's a pandemic. By what the news says, right? It's a crisis all over the world, and you got these scammers, these scheming, evil, disgusting ass people doing this shit. And I'm sure, being that they do it so much, and I've experienced it so much, luckily I'm not. Luckily I'm grown enough and I've experienced enough to know that these are bullshit, and I'm aware I pay attention to stuff. And I got a good memory. But, I'm sure people have been scammed out their ass. Especially considering that most of these women in these pitches, that I'm sure it ain't them. And in some cases, I think it is that woman. Where she's just tricking herself out. Saying she'll send nude photos or something like that for money. What you do what you want, it's your body, but then don't ask me to respect you. <laughs> but uh, anyway, that's all I had to say. I, I just think it's disgusting, man. It's just disgusting. And people like this, K-Z, K-A-Y-Z-E-E, -E, all stars. Facebook. You need to get on it, man. If she's not an employee and representative, y'all, y'all need to, y'all need to. Just, here, while I'm on here, let me do this. You should record it. Profile. I'll show you what I'm talking about. I should, should, should show you what I'm talking about. Come to profile. You gonna let me? Watch. You ain't gonna let me. There we go. <sighs> okay, so that's Kate Wells, Texas a &M. Yeah, she's, she's beautiful. One mutual friend. Mm -hmm. And then boom. That's exactly 100% how every single one of these fucking scammers are. Excuse my language again. They'll only have pitches or only have updates till November 28th or something like that. And they'll have one or two pitches posted. The quick is scammers. Facebook Marketplace Assistant. Former owner 
at Facebook Marketplace Assistant. I mean, does she think I'm an idiot? Former owner at Facebook Marketplace Assistant posting on Marketplace, you know, saying she's an assistant. So she's an assistant at somebody's Marketplace that's most likely free. How's she a former owner at Facebook Marketplace Assistant? Did she start it? No, I doubt it. Anyways, I can't stand people like this, man. <laughs> Went to Texas Online Preparatory High School. Then studied at Texas A&M University. Went to Texas Online Preparatory High School, then studied at Texas A&M University. I call bullshit. <sighs> I call bullshit. Texas A&M University is not like up there with Duke or probably not even Caliber Wake Forest, but they're still a really good school. And I very seriously doubt, even if this girl had a 4.0 or a 5.0 in high school. And a 5.0 you can get if you take AP classes and you take extra blah, blah, blah in high school. I very seriously doubt that Texas Online Preparatory High School, and I could be wrong. Is an accredited school. And I doubt. I ain't going to talk about it. Anyways, get these people off the internet, man. I mean, people like this be on the internet. I don't want to shut down people's freedom of speech and all that, but when people are trying to scam people like this and lying to them solely. Trying to get money out of them, cause that's what she's a. That's what that this person's about to ask. If I continue the conversation, which I'm not going to, I don't want to. Just don't want to deal with it. Usually, I'll screw with them, and then when it gets to the asking for money point, I'm like, I I'll give them some sly remark or something like that. But I, I just I'm just I'm tired of it. Anyways. It's disgusting. I just wanna I wanna show you. I mean let's look at the photos. Right, let's look at the I wanna see if it's the same if it's one of the same people. Huh. One profile picture. This is definitely a scam. Duh. And one cover picture. One cover. Let's see the cover photos. One cover photo. Kiss my ass. You think somebody's stupid. And then, hell, that might be the real person right there. That made this account. Possibly. That might be the real person that made this account and then responded on it to make it look like it's a real thing. Like somebody's an idiot. Come on now. But people are that stupid. So she can go fuck herself. Again. This is disgusting. But. This is mostly intrigued. Used to be the persuasive voice. And here soon, it's not going to be mostly intrigued anymore. I'm thinking of a new channel for me, YouTube. I haven't posted in a very long time. But I want to get back to it. I've got into PCs, building PCs. I've got into all kinds of different stuff since the pandemic hit and had nothing to do I don't know we'll see 
But like, share, comment, subscribe. Boop. Please. Or not. Please.